And one lucky local veteran will be getting a big surprise come Sunday. And Foxy P's Kelsey Nemisto has that story. Kelsey. Then it's really a heartwarming story. The veteran and his family are away for the weekend, and Northern Michigan University students have taken over their home. But it's not what you may think. When the vet returns home Sunday evening, the students are hoping he'll be overjoyed. My favorite part is being able to watch a bunch of guys come together and get something accomplished. We just really all enjoy seeing the way things come together and seeing how we can benefit the people around us with our time. Dozens of volunteers from Northern Michigan University's Construction Club and Volunteer Center began tearing out flooring and screwing down boards today in a stranger's home. It's all a part of the Volunteer Center's annual Home Improvement Service Project. We had a bunch of applicants um, and we went out and visited all their houses and talked with them and touched base with them and uh, at the end of it this house was definitely the one that was in the most need. Um, so we decided to go for it because it was also within our budget. Thanks to a number of sponsors and a $7,500 grant from Wells Fargo, the students were able to purchase building materials and restore the home of a local veteran, which was in dire need of repair. The students are installing new flooring, reshingling a shed, yard cleanup, painting, and other small projects around the home. There was a lot of rot in the floor, so we're cutting that all out. We're putting, we're repairing that. We're putting a new subfloor in and then putting a nice new uh, finished floor in so they can have a little more ease with their wheelchairs because that was a big concern. All of the students present said the most rewarding part of the project is knowing your time and efforts are helping someone in need. Just knowing that you're uh, making someone's time a little bit easier, I would say. Just taking a little bit of weight off of people's shoulders. The students will continue working on their project through Sunday. More volunteers are welcome and needed. If you would like to volunteer, just check out our website, UpperMichiganSource.com. Ben? All right, that's a great story. Thanks a lot, Kelsey. Thanks.